Stephen Bishop was a slave who belonged to Franklin Gorham. He set Stephen Bishop to work as a guide in the cave. Stephen made it his business to uh, look at all the passages and to see where they went and saw that the cave ended at a place called Bottomless Pit. One day a visitor came who was interested in seeing more of the cave and he said, uh, well, let's do something that nobody's done before. Stephen said, well, all right, we'll, uh, we'll go down to the bottomless pit and see about getting across that. Anybody who did any guiding would know that you, it's not easy to get across a pit. But Stephen had realized that this survey had gone through a side passage, so he took this guy through the side passage and uh, climbed out on the edge of bottomless pit and along on a narrow ledge down into another shallow pit and presto, he had crossed the bottomless pit. Well, they went on on that trip and discovered uh, Echo River, River Hall, and passages beyond. Stephen's total addition to the cave amounted to some uh, probably 20 more miles of the cave. So he found more of Mammoth Cave than any other single person that I know of. And he made a map which was based on the surveyed eight miles plus his own impression of where the rest of the cave went. The map has a few peculiar things in it. One is a passage leading off of Echo River that nobody had been able to find well, it turns out that in 1972, the connection uh, from the Flint Ridge cave system was made through that passage. 